Welcome back everyone, hope you're having an awesome day, and today we're going to continue on our Yarn Shisha campaign on hard, because we're real gamers here. Last mission, we destroyed all the Bohemian villages and decimated the enemy fortress in One-Eyed Wanderer, and now we need to fight a glorious battle for courage and coin. So make sure to like, comment, subscribe, we're going to do all the campaigns on hard, get all the achievements where we can. This can be a little difficult, they send a lot of big armies towards you, and it can be pretty... Overwhelming is probably the best word to, way to put it. As you see, I've already beaten the mission. I beat it. Uh, long story short, tried to get it out before uh, Retold came out. Didn't end up getting it done. So I'm just going to replay through and uh, do all the missions again. So sit back, relax, grab yourself a coffee, and let's move on to Yan Shishka 2. Courage and coin. Let's do this. Just as all hope fades, an angel swoops in to deliver the desperate from the abyss. Such is the way of things. It is what it is. Yan Sokol, my patron and benefactor. Sugar Daddy, yep, yep, we understand, yep. Savior. The generous man who backed my expeditions exhorted King Wenceslaus, now restored to the throne, to demand that I be spared from a horrific death. Oh. After securing my release, Sokol bestowed yet another honor upon me and made me an officer in his army of cell swords. We were good boys, so we get a lot of I gifts. March at the head of that force. But for now, our sights are not set on Bohemia. To the northeast, a savage conflict has erupted between two age-old enemies. The Teutonic Order, the boys, yep. fanatical brotherhood of Crusader Knights wages war upon the growing kingdom of Poland. King Władysław Jagiełło of Poland, still known as Jogaila by I like your guy. I think we say that from now on. has taken the initiative and struck deep into Teutonic territory. Knowing that his Polish and Lithuanian army is not enough to achieve his ambitions, he has enlisted our famed company of Bohemian mercenaries. Bohemian knights. We are among the best I know, right? in That's Europe. Completely different. The Teutonic knights and their crusader allies are a formidable match. On the plains near Grunwald, courage will yield coin, or else a glorious death. Preferably the coin, not the death. You know what? We'll compromise. Glorious coin. Sounds like a good plan. I like that. Yo, guy, I'm not even going to try and say that. Must survive, defeat the Teutonic Order, or kill the three Teutonic Commanders, Ulrich von Unigen, Friedrich von Wallenrod, and Kuno von Liechtenstein. That was terrible. When just not going to completely go past that. Jan Shishka and Jan Sokol begin in the Imperial Age and can support a population of 150. Prudent rationing of supplies means that gathered resources will last significantly longer than usual. Castles and stone walls cannot be constructed in this mission. Your army has gathered to do battle, not to erect fortifications. I mean, castles can kind of do battle for me, so it's kind of counterproductive there. Strike a balance between holding the center and supporting your allies on the flanks. If either are routed, victory will become much harder to achieve. Bohemian spear units do additional bonus damage to cavalry. Use this advantage against the heavy mounted forces of your enemies. Sure. Jan Zizka and Jan Sokol's mercenary army is a raid on the plains near Grunwald in the center of the Polish force, immediately in front of the command post of King Władysław Jagiełło. The Polish army has lined up on the left flank. To the south, its forces are comprised of heavy cavalry and infantry. The Lithuanian army is deployed on the right. Uh, to the east, its ranks are filled with cavalry, pikemen, and skirmishers. The Teutonic Order camps across the field to the west. I don't know why it started there. And Northwest, its dread armies are composed of heavy cavalry, infantry, crossbowmen, and cannons. The Order's Crusader allies, don't understand why it's not just one thing, but sure, have taken up position in the north, opposite the Lithuanians. They bring heavy cavalry and infantry to the battlefield. Enemy morale hinges on the welfare of its commanders. It will plummet, should they fall. Uh, there's a lot of talking, so we're just going to start building our town centers. It's just so we're all aware, you know? Two, three. On this bright day that the one there. The three. Do and one down your here. Oh, two swords. Thank you. If you lack space to deploy your ranks, we shall be glad to see you. Oh, thank you. Accept your sword Don't accept it. They just insulted you. What kind of king are you, Yogala? What's going on here? Whose name we fight do not look favorably upon the prideful and arrogant. Arrogant. 
Yeah, you tell them. Take your Lithuanian forces and throw out the enemy flank. There's a lot of talking. You think I'm joking? The Lithuanian rabble is attacking. Christ is their standing. Hit them now, Zavisha. Bogorodzica! Far too long have I rested in the shade. Are you still no, they're still going. The hour to draw my dread blade. Go forth now and crush these fools. God mit uns. Okay. Yeah? Okay, cool. So yeah, after all that talking, as you saw, I just completely ignored it. We're just gonna go right for Hoofnitsa, I think. Yeah, let's do it. We got Hoofnitsa right right away, let's get it. Halberdeer and uh, Arbalist. Get all our um, blacksmith techs and just build lots of buildings. It's basically a deathmatch, just build lots of stuff and start getting your eco set up. As you see, we got our town center down here, focus on like your gold and wood. Uh, we got some villagers here, they're gathering food for us now. Let's get some uh, villagers out onto... Oh yeah, no, you just keep cutting trees, I suppose, these ones. And then we'll get five onto gold as well, hey? While that's all happening, as you'll see soon enough, group one, uh, all the armies go up and just... Oh my goodness, it's so many. Let's, let's get absolutely wrecked, so good luck to them, I guess. And uh, greens are the greens still alive, actually. Good on them. My goodness. And, um... Yeah, basically we just need to get our stuff all ready and just stop. Don't let them build anything on our side of the base. Oi! What do you think you're doing? Nice. That'll that'll learn them. And we'll get Hoofnitsa, which will make our Bombard Cannons extra stonk and chonk. We'll get our uh, barracks all selected. We'll get all our archery ranges. And we'll get our... Uh, stables there but i'm not too worried about it at the moment we can just not do that please thank you what do you think you're going he's running away cool he can stay there uh we'll get siege engineers we'll get architecture might come in handy who knows i suppose you never really know uh more villagers out we'll get uh woodcutters i suppose actually let's get some farms out here just to kind of start that going. And really, it's just kind of, um, just build your force up. We don't need to attack right away. This army will just get absolutely wrecked regardless. So what we'll do is we'll actually focus on getting some, um... You know what I actually want to try? Because it is Teutons. I kind of want to try Scorpions. I've... Ever since I played as the Kamai... I kind of like scorpions, and I don't know how I feel about it, you know? Because I used to always meme on scorpions being bad, and then I actually kind of started using it, you know? So let's get a mark it up. Uh, villages, alright, you're all done. How many houses? I need a couple more houses, so we'll go one there. That's another 15, that should be a 150, I think. So they enough. Just start building all these farms, eh? One, two, uh, there. Nice. So build that. Build this one. And then after that, I suppose you come and be a farmer? I don't know. All these ones will be farmers at some point too, eh? Uh, what have we got here? Five, you start, uh, let's start the Great Hunt, I say. And we're actually going to play relatively defensive, just for this first bit. Just while I get my eco up, but also they attack pretty early. And uh, if you go on the offensive, yeah, that's probably good for you in the long run. But I'm going to be honest with you, I'd rather just play defensive and get like a good uh, defense going here. So let's start getting some archers out. There's some arbalists and uh, cannoneers. And I think uh, we do have that. Sell that stone, since we can't build anything with it. What's the point in having it then, you know? And honestly, we might just wait till I can get some, uh, start getting some boys out. It's all our food. Uh, I can at least get two cannons out, so we'll start getting those out. Start building up that little force, you know. Uh, so a little bit of wood. Yeah, nah, it didn't help as much as I kind of hoped it would, you know. 
If I get some more uh, gold miners then, that's fine. They're going for gold too, beautiful. And yeah, basically we just um, defend and hope for the best here. Hopefully uh, green can hold off, it looks like they're doing pretty well there. And we're just going to do a big like loop once we can. Uh, we'll come this way and then we'll come up and start hitting this way. That'll be the plan anyway. But I want to keep an eye because uh, they will send a big army if you leave an unprotected base. And we don't like unprotected bases. Um, okay. Just do, I don't really care what you do, mate. Just do a woodcutting upgrade. Let's get that going. I've got a pretty good gold eco right now. We've got five, like, we've got 15 on gold, basically. Food's doing all right. And, just, like, I, eventually it's going to be, like, there's not going to be a problem at all, you know? That'll be 15 on food. And then, um, all these... Cow gatherers. Oh, what are you doing? Let's move the cows kind of just into the uh, town center, you know? But all these people become farmers as well. Or berry gatherers or something. What's our army looking like? 60 units? That's a good stock. I thought they were going to attack, honestly, you know? I thought they would have attacked by now. I'm not really sure what they're waiting for. I don't want to score. I'm, I was beaming, actually. I don't want a scorpion. Maybe I will build some scorpions at some point. But for now, I would just rather get some cannons out. Just for the, uh... You know, the actual... Knocking out buildings and stuff. Looks like yellow's attacking. Black's just kind of moving around, yep. Okay, or grey, I suppose. Grey, black, same to me. Uh, do we get Cavalier? I mean, we can afford it. Yeah, sure, we'll get Cavalier. Not too important. We will not be building any swordsmen whatsoever. We're going against Teutons, which have high melee armor. It, like, I may as well just shoot myself in the foot at that point. We're not going to do that. Maybe I will build some scorpions, you know. Let's get four out after we get these hoof meters out. Couple of cannoneers and arbalists. And couple of halberdiers. And some horses, eh? Just to defend here. Okay. Group two, group one, let's go. Oh, black's attacking up here. Uh let's defend let's see if we can help actually. Let's go in and try and do something here. While that's happening, I'll move my uh bombards. We'll just move them down here, I reckon. Put them on no attack stance so I don't go shooting things I shouldn't. What we'll do is we'll attack move up here, but we'll shift click our horses and use them to knock out the siege here quickly. So I don't lose buildings, you know? I have no idea what's wrong with my army. What is going on here? What are, like, see? Like, I don't really understand. All right now we retreat, 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 run away. Attack move this way. Let's go, everyone. And just let the archers, let the archers and that do the work. Look at that. You focus on all this, please. Nice. Those poor two tonic knights don't know what hit them. Did we get them? Beautiful. Good use of my time, I reckon. I'll just get a handful more units here. Group one. Alright, group one, we're going to come over here now. Oh, hang on, get rid of this one. I mean, we helped them. We don't need to, like, defeat everything there. Surely they can take on three Teutonic Knights, you know? And if they can't, then my goodness, why do I even have you all here, you know? Alright, let's get a couple more archers out. Let's kind of bring them here. And this will be our little defensive base here, basically. Alright, Hoofnitzel, let's start moving over here. Just kind of scout for us a bit. 
arm is coming across anyway, so it should be fine. Come on, just look at these boys. They look so cool, the Crusader Knights. Like, just the sprite itself is so cool. Nice, we're at max population, so I love to see. We'll just move our cannons up here by the gold mines as we bring our army up. Is there a second army attacking? My goodness. I suppose there's two, two tiny bases, but still, that's so rude. Now, I'm not entirely sure, right? But I'm pretty sure if we knock out these houses, it's it lowers their population, you know? So, we'll knock them out while we're here. We'll get rid of that marker too. And the off chance they try to start trading or whatever. And we're just going to want to defend our, uh, our boys, honestly. Siege Engineers, Hoof Need, sir? That's all you kind of need, you know? Look at that. That poor house didn't know what was coming. Start moving up. Please. Ballistics, please. Nice. Alright, uh, we might put these ones on defense mode so I don't go running off, you know. And, nice. Alright, we got rid of that cannon, beautiful. Let's get rid of this uh, tower, please. And see, they're bringing all their forces up. Get rid of this, please, thank you. And we can knock out all their, start knocking out military buildings, you know. And just have our troops here. They'll just defend and hold hold the fort there for us. My goodness. Beautiful. Let's get rid of the houses, tents and stuff. Again, lower population, I'm hoping at least. And if it helps as well, because uh, the castle has crenellations, I don't know if this was by design or just it happened to work that way. Uh, but where their gate, where their walls are, is basically the castle range. So as long as you stay out of the base from the front here, um, you'll be okay. We're just going to start knocking out all their other buildings here. Grey looks like they're attacking green pretty heavily there, but they're alive, so that's the main thing. Like, they're still, they're doing alright. They're holding. That was a noise. Lots of military units being built for some reason. I'm just going to knock out all their military buildings so they stop building troops against us, you know? And really, like, the Siege Workshops we're going to get. Siege Workshop and that, just because, um... Bombard cannons are annoying. To say the least. Alright, so see, uh, see how we're getting hit by those crenellations? We need to be smart when we do, do the actual assault. Get rid of that villager. I don't know where she's going, but get rid of her. Alright, so see how we got like all this stuff here? I'd rather deal with these troops first. So let's just retreat our, uh, our cannons. Get back here, please. My goodness. Go one at a time, honestly. Like, I don't really care. Blue's coming in to assist. Nice. Not as useless as I thought they were going to be. Nice, okay. Now here's the cool thing, right? Blue should come in and start meat shielding for us. Go this way, we start hitting the, start hitting that castle. Actually, let's hit this tower if we can first. And then we start pushing, let's go. What's our army like? Nice, they did come to attack us, but we stopped them, beautiful. We'll send this army up now. And we'll go back to making a nice, again, just Refill the army, a couple of calves, why not? And we'll go heavy scorpion, and I'll build a couple of scorpions as well. Alright, I've still got my uh, towers, excellent. The greatest swordsman, hoisted by his own petard. No petards are here, but you know. No, they're not, that's right. As long as we kind of just. Nice work inscription, beautiful. Alright, good work, cannons. Let's knock out the towers. And once we knock out all these military buildings, like, they stop building such a big force against us, you know? 
Oh, I don't know what you're really doing. Can we get rid of this tower, please? My goodness. Everyone here, group one. Let's retreat. We don't need to fight the towers, please. And as I said, I'm not sure if knocking out the uh, houses actually helps. Oh, hello. We're getting attacked by yellow, it looks like. Attack me, let's go. Loads of how it is, surely, you know? Let's just get loads more of these boys in. Okay, you can do that and start, I don't know, gathering that. What's happening up here? Group one, let's just come this way. Tower. Nice. We'll just attack me this way, let's go. Use our cannons to smack everything we can. There we go. See, like, we defended. Scorpions actually kind of came in clutch, eh? not gonna lie. And I'm pretty sure, I don't know if it's coming out yet, but I do remember they were gonna add ballistics to scorpions. I couldn't tell you what part, what, you know, what the game uh, version is. All I know is that they were going to do it. Bring everything down here, please. Up more. All right, what's happening here? All right, we're um, we're pushing forward. My goodness. Okay. Oh, hello. We're getting a, we're getting rear banged here. Help. Yeah, don't worry about them. You focus on these ones. Let's go. My poor cannons. I have three cannons left now. Alright, yellow's coming in for the assault, let's go. Blue's coming up, nice. You're not the only one who could flank, boy. Let's kind of try and keep them, like, out of range, you know? When look, we're rebuilding the army, I suppose that's good enough, you know? There goes the Bombard. Run, who needs it? Yeah, we have no uh, halberdies here, so... I think we just, we die with dignity. We charge forward into the abyss and hope for the best. We have an army here, it's fine. No wounds, don't Hoof needs a... I will soon be back. Mark my words. Group one. I'm gonna keep all these here. I would much rather just not have... Group one, beautiful. Oh, green's coming up, my goodness. Oh, they're building forward but How deep? They're building forward bases here. Get rid of that, then. Once we get these Hufenitsa out. Lost two houses? How do we lose two houses? I mean, sure. Why not, I guess. Just build... I don't even know where my house went there, but sure. Nice. As you see, like, we're, we're holding. We've taken out one of the peoples already. Um, the only problem is obviously all the... Goodness. Okay. What does my army consist of here? Yeah, I think there should be enough range and all that. Maybe we just go for the greys here and then we push forward. That might be a better plan. Yeah, get rid of that, please. Alright, we'll attack him and get rid of that. Group one. Oh, no, we got troops here. Let's go. Group two. Alright, we'll, do, we'll deal with their Teutonic Knights and stuff. And honestly, if you get rid of their Teutonic Knights, you can just literally just spam out how many is. So if we knock out their other castle, we should be right, you know. Cancel that. Uh, we'll get Arbalists and Hand Cannoneers. We'll cancel that. And just Scout. We'll just need meat shields at this point. Uh, and with our other two Hufnitsa, Group 2. We'll start just, like, bombarding their base here. As we play defense with our units. Attack move. Let's go. Group 
one. And we're just going to attack, and again, we just play defense. We play defense, we hit them from in front, and we let our hoof needs to do the rest. Bombard cannon, let's maybe get rid of that. That would be very handy for us. Let's go get rid of everything here. Uh, we'll use our cannons to get rid of that boy, thank you. Good work, everyone. Cannons are still alive, beautiful. Let's get rid of these. Whoa. Are you still talking? Bitter means sorry, so you will be sorry when I'm done with you. Wait, bitter? No, please. Well, never mind. Let's not talk about it. I'm not German in so long, right? I forget words. Words are hard to remember. Let's not be here! Cannons is an onager! Nice. I mean, there was one, I suppose. Group one. Retreat, two tonic knights. Nice. Okay, attack move. Let's go. Thank you. All right, orange is taken out. Attack move. Let's go. Let the cannons deal with that. Beautiful. Let's run away because the cannon. Oh, I hope it's. A... Oh no. Okay. Playing this game where it's not ideal, you know. Group one. Attack move up here. Everyone here, attack move up here, please. Let's just retreat. We'll just retreat. We'll just take them on. Group one. Get rid of that, let's go. Hurrah. Alright, nice. No, it's all good, it's all good. Alright. Regroup, reassess, restart shooting. <laughs> just built forward barracks down there. Don't know how they got past my impregnable defense, but they did it. Alright, you need to go on no attack sense, please. Group one, let's go. Okay. Okay. Green, what are you doing? We need assistance. Okay, we have a stop. Alright, let's charge forward. We'll take out the boy. We'll just wait, just see if we can kind of get rid of that while they're nice. Yep, you get rid of this boy, let's go. Just I want to try and knock out old mate there, you know. Alright, let's start bombarding. Yeah, 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 we've got the, we've got the advantage, let's go. Run! Oh, we lost two cannons because I decided to move. Should have just stood my ground, you know. Oh, my troops not being made. Let's refill that line up. And... Yep. Goodness, what happened here? How did I lose my... Well, I know how I lost them, don't worry. I don't know why I even started saying that. Here, let's go. Attack move this way, let's go. Archers, attack move this way, let's get rid of all this stuff. Here's the bonus, right? We shouldn't be too... It might actually be easier to try and get rid of this person. And I'm going to be honest, I'm just going to spam out some halberdiers. Let's just get this spam going with halberdiers. I'm going to sell some wood. And we... Just get this halberdier spam going. 
in here. Let's go. Attack move this way. Group one. And we can probably take out the enemy here. What are we at? We're at 30 minutes. That's actually better than my last time. Um, because we could push up, but I don't know if we'll actually beat them. Um, at least too aggressively. Alright, Blue's here now. They'll help take that out. Good, good. Group one. Let's start pushing up. Just because I have to... Now I have to build more siege, you know? So if we, um... I do have my hoof needs to here, I suppose. So that's not too bad. Forty-six halberd is. I think we can rush, honestly. Let's just keep following. We'll just start attacking wherever, honestly. Yep. We should knock out his paladins pretty effectively. And we'll just follow green. In theory, green I'm hoping will go this way, but I doubt it now, looking at it. But there's a lot of boys there, you know? We'll help knock this out while we're there. Take our ranged contingent up now. Nice. We'll bring them up to kind of distract the enemy, you know. Hit the uh, siege workshop. Group one. Green, you cowards! Come back and fight! Are you. Excuse me? So rude. Oh, 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 so rude. Group two. Group two, you deal with that. Group one deals with this. Yep, get rid of these two things. Let's go. Nice. It's enough to just be annoying, you know, in terms of like having. Oh, okay, retreat. Get rid of that paladin, please. Thank you. Group two. Attack move. Group two. Attack move. Hoof needs up. Go for that. Retreat, retreat, retreat. Right, they're coming into the arch fire. Beautiful. Look at that. Now we attack move. Nice. Get rid of all those horses. Green, I need your help. We need to push up. We need to hit yellow. They will brew the day. Oh, they will brew the day. Cannoneers, I don't care about anything else. Yep, let's just keep charging up. Attack move up. Because all we need to do is just knock out old mate, you know? My goodness. And you see, black is still coming in. Like, they're still coming in for stuff, so... Let's hope we have enough archers here that won't be a problem, you know? I mean, because they can deal with, like, infantry, and that's really the cavalry that's the problem. <laughs> Lovely. Oh, green's here. Beautiful. Remember that. Beautiful. Because green will take the hits for us, you know? So I'm okay with that. And worst case, they, they take out the commander as well, so that actually works out pretty well for us. Let's go. Push forward, boys. Let's go. You little... Oh, oh, oh. oh this village is going to get it. Oh, this village is going to get it. Get here. That's what I thought. Just put them there and they can stand ground there. Hey, right, how many halberds do I have? I have a lot. Alright. Let's go. What we're going to do is we're going to push up and we're just going to use all our archers to just kind of just tank everything for us as we charge in. Charge in and take the commander. Use these boys. We could probably... I don't know if we stand and fight though. Oh, we could probably fight the... You know, we could fight the paladins and stuff here. Do loads of damage to them. Nice. And now we push forward. 40 plus units here, I think. 30 plus uh, help it is. Let's go. Oh, look. See, look. He's running. He knows. He's like, what? No way. I'm not fighting that. And that's it. Done. Woo. Nice. Two Titanic Commanders defeated. Yes. 
That's actually way easier than taking out Grey, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> we have Triumph. Look at that, 35 minutes. Gaude Mata Polonia! Dos Vidanya and such. Excellent work, if I say so myself. Our victory was terrible, but great. For decades, great, that's the main thing. Travelers team. will be stunned by the graveyard left by this clash of arms. The greatest in living memory. With the Teutonic army crushed, we lost no time in pressing our advantage. Yeah, why would you? The castle of Rodzinia quickly fell to our forces. Rodzinia. But this triumph came at a tragic cost. My patron, Jan Sokol. Not our sugar daddy. Almost like a second father to me. Perished of poison. Coward's weapon. The base fate unworthy of such a marvelous leader. A joyous affair it was for the Polish king and his allies. But for us, it was a melancholy end. We now march home to our beloved Bohemia. Pockets lined with coin, but hearts bitter with the sorrow of loss. We've won, but at what cost? Was it worth Sugar Daddy's life? So we go to return map. Um, yeah, as you see, like, if you knock out the, a little bit of their eco off the back here especially, they become very, like, not a problem. Uh, coming this way and knocking out their town centers and all their villages as well, You'll just, if you do that, I mean, at that point, you could probably still come here and take them out. Uh, but yeah, it's just, um, like, taking out this base and knocking out all these buildings, as you saw, the only way we were kind of getting attacked was, like, when they would make units this way, or from yellow. And then afterwards, I was just like, you know what, we'll just take the commander out, because we got green coming in, hitting them pretty hard. I was working out for, <laughs> look at this. And they do love to build forward bases. There you go. Thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. Let me know down below if I helped you beat the mission, if it was a bit too difficult and I was able to uh, put you on the right path, as Jan Solko did to us. And now we move on to untested waters in uh, the Iron Lords in the next mission. Catch you around.